Hey golf people, on today's episode we're taking a look at the new X5 Golf Smartwatch from ShotScope. Now this little guy could be the best bang for your buck golf smartwatch on the market right now. And I am 100% confident that when used to its full potential, this little device will make you a better golfer. I'll explain in this video. All right guys, now let's cover the major features of this golf smartwatch, what it can do for you. Like all golf watches out there, this is going to give you accurate front, middle, and back yardages to the pin. We'll talk about exactly how accurate it is here shortly. Another feature of this watch is distance to hazard, so you'll see exactly how far it is to carry the water, to carry the bunker, and all of the various hazards there on course. Another feature of this watch is the ability to quickly move the flag stick to different points on the green. So when you're out there on the golf course and you see that the pin is front right or back left or wherever it is on the green, you can literally tell this watch and that way you'll get the most accurate yardages to the flag stick. Now one thing that this watch does, and it does it I think exceptionally, is track your clubs and the distances that you hit them and where you hit them out on course. The way you do that is by inserting sensors that ShotScope includes inside of the package. You screw those into the butt end of your club and when you're out there on course, the watch will recognize which club you're hitting when. The X5 has scorekeeping built into it and you can actually very easily edit your score on the fly out on the course. When you're done with each hole, you'll verify the score. And don't worry, if you make a mistake, it's very easy within the X5's menu system to go change the score for that hole and get yourself back on track. Now, one thing that I really like about this watch is in addition to that color touchscreen, it also has this tactile button which you can use to navigate the menu system and change screens. Maybe I'm old school, but I just love having buttons to do things like that on watches and rangefinders. And post round is where I think this watch really shines. We're gonna get into that in just a moment here. ShotScope claims there are 36,000 golf courses built into this device. And if for some reason the course that you play is not included, they will get it updated and mapped within five days, which is a pretty cool claim. This watch is also capable of measuring your steps. And what's nice is post round, it'll actually tell you how far you travel during that round. Now that's it for the major features of this watch on course, but it actually gets better and I think more powerful after the round. And I think this thing is missing one feature that I'm shocked it does, but I think you're really going to appreciate. Stay tuned for that, but before we do, let's talk about the materials of this watch. First off, this watch is water resistant to 50 meters, which is a decent depth. It's definitely enough to go swimming and not have to worry about water ingressing into the system and ruining your new golf smart watch. Another nice feature of this watch is the ceramic bezel. This is going to provide a good layer of scratch resistance, keeping this watch looking new and looking fresh for years to come. Now, a couple interesting things about the construction of this watch. The band itself is fixed and ShotScope uses these hex screws in order to attach the watch band to the watch. It is possible to change out the bands, but it's not as easy as some of the quick change systems out on the market. Now, another interesting quirk about the construction of this watch is the watch band to me is actually backwards where the clasp fits on your wrist is opposite from most watches. With ShotScope being based in Scotland, maybe it's a Scottish thing, I don't know. All right guys, now before we move into the category and talk about the accuracy of this device, I wanna give a shout out to playbetter.com, the sponsor of our show, who stocks the X5 watches along with all of the best golf technology on planet Earth in one place. They offer you free 48 hour shipping within the continental United States and they've got a hassle-free 60-day money-back guarantee. I've got a link down below. If you want to purchase the ShotScope X5, please do so through our links. It definitely helps support Let's Play Through and what we're doing here. All right, guys, now it's time to talk about the accuracy of this watch. Well, good news, guys. Out on course, I found this thing to be accurate to within three yards maximum, and oftentimes it was accurate to only one yard, and sometimes it was spot on. So many times when I locked onto the target, looked down at my watch, this thing was right there within, like I said, a yard and maximum three yards. So that's going to be the accuracy that I found out on course. Here's an example on a short par three where I actually hit the flag stick. I looked down at my watch and the distance to me was exactly the same. All right guys, now let's get into where this watch really shines and it's post round in its data analysis. What's great about the post round analysis within the ShotScope app is that you can go back and look at every shot and it's easy to edit a shot if you missed the shot or you missed a putt, for instance, 
or even if you need to add a penalty stroke, I had to do that. The stats this thing provides are insanely in depth. You get all the stuff you'd think of like fairways hit, greens and regulation, how far you hit the clubs, but it goes even deeper into how accurate you are with a particular club if you tend to miss left or right or if you are hitting greens or missing greens with certain irons. It's legit mind boggling. Now all of this data can be modeled to track performance over time, as well as compare yourself versus different handicap ranges, all the way from really high handicaps to touring professionals. So it's really a great device in order to set goals and figure out what is working in your game and what needs improvement. The really powerful feature of this data analysis comes in the strokes game data, which I think ShotScope does as good, if not better than anyone else out on the market. With strokes game data, you can see what clubs you need to practice, where your misses are, and what parts of your game need the most help. This will legit make you a better golfer by showing you what you need to practice on and improve in your game. All right, guys, let's talk about what's missing with the new ShotScope X5. And the major thing that I see missing is a subscription. So many of these platforms are going to a paywall model where you have to purchase a monthly subscription in order to unlock all the features and benefits of that device. What I love about this watch, and I think you will love too, is the fact that there is no subscription. All of that amazing next level data is open to you and free to use after you purchase this watch. I think that's so cool and my hat is off to ShotScope for not getting greedy with us. And on top of it, ShotScope has promised to offer full green maps in a future update. So I cannot wait to see that feature roll out as well. Well, I always say that nothing is perfect, especially when it comes to golf technology. So here's a few things that I would wish or I would have changed. First off, just from an aesthetic point of view, I like the round shape of this watch. They've gone away from that rectangle design, but in terms of the wristband, I think that could have been a little bit better. I'm a watch guy. I would have liked to see a little taper with the band itself, give it a little bit more of an elegant look. This is a much more industrial looking design. That said, I'll probably only ever wear this watch out on the golf course, so it may or may not even be a big deal to you. The other thing that I noticed out on course was that to assure that I had the right club selected, I oftentimes had to actually physically tap the club up against the watch out on course. Then I got the verification that I had the right club in my hand. It would be nice if it would sense it a little bit easier. I know with some other systems out there, sometimes just you taking that club out of the bag triggers the system. And while that's not a huge deal, I did miss one club out on course, which I then had to go back and change. So I think that part can definitely be improved. Luckily, you can go back into the app and add those shots and add those clubs, change those clubs if need be, but it'd be nice if it worked out of the box, just a little smoother. Now, the last little gripe that I've got is that because I'm a walker, when my golf bag and my golf cart were parked next to the green, it sometimes went into the finished hole mode where I literally start entering putts. And I feel like it didn't catch some of the chip shots when I was just off the green or on the apron. And guys, that's very common with a lot of golf smart watches, Garmin watches included. All of them struggle when you get really close to the green and sometimes measuring putts and that sort of thing. So I can give it a little bit of a pass there, but it would be nice if it worked a little bit more smoothly. But that's pretty much it. In general, I absolutely loved my experience and on course with the ShotScope X5. I highly recommend it. I think this watch sits in a very, very nice price point for your average golfer who wants something a little bit of a step up from something like the Bushnell Ion Elite that does the basics very well, but wants a little bit more of that data, the club tracking and so on and so forth. But you're not necessarily willing to spend the money on a top of the line Garmin device or some of those really expensive watches out on the market. I think this thing is in a really nice sweet spot. I can't wait to see what happens. And again, I think ShotScope has done us all a favor by not hiding its best features behind a paywall or a subscription service. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this review. If you are searching for golf smartwatches, highly recommend you check out this video where I really rank and break down all of the options out on the market. I'll catch you back here very soon on another edition of Let's Play Through.